buyer partnership. Okay. So who are suppliers? Who is supplier? Santos. Okay. Santos is supplier. So what? What is Understand each other. 
and they should be independent of each other and respect each other right so that is the first mandatory principle it is between a buyer and supplier relationship partnership is so both is responsible for for their independence okay both should respect each other okay that is the first thing and second principle is both supplier and seller should responsible for the the contract or the the the, the bond which uh, they are signing okay so if that the bond or the contract or whatever what it says so how long uh, they have a relation they have they are in partnership uh, then uh, both are responsible for the quality overall quality and quantity of items then price and mode of delivery and in terms of payment okay in terms of return item rejection so in all in terms both should be responsible okay so both are responsible for all these are uh, factors which affect the, the quality of the service okay then the supplier is responsible mainly uh, the customer is or the buyer is responsible for narrating what actually they are uh, they are in what are their requirements okay and they have to uh, insist them they have to tell their or uh, disseminate their principles their quality policies okay make the supplier to understand what uh, mode of uh, what uh, principles are followed in a the uh, the uh, the buyer okay so they have to understand it. okay so quality is important means so they have to understand so what mode of quality they are looking for okay so then so the customer has to explain clearly their requirement actual requirement likewise in terms of quantity what are their requirements i am looking for for example water supply so they are from the supply the water supplier so every day supply is for a 1000 bottles or 2000 bottles okay my demand is 2000 bottles in a contract i sign like that but they are supplying the 1000 bottles only they have a capacity to supply 1000 bottles only so what is happen what is happen so there is a possibility of breaking the contract and the supplier moves the contract and the buyer looking for an other better supplier okay so both are responsible for this so supplier uh, buyer have to clearly narrate what their requirement is actually okay in terms of quality quantity price and the kind of delivery what they are expecting so the in time delivery or uh, 42 hours advance delivery or 24 hours advance delivery is like that okay so type of delivery what they are expecting. and type of payment what they can do okay so like that so all they have to explain to the supplier so that is the responsibility of a buyer so what are the responsibility of the supplier in terms of all these things so supplier is responsible for delivering item in time okay and responsible for the quantity what is the actual quantity required so that they should respond for delivering that amount okay same thing so i am asking for demanding for 2000 rupees so they have to supply they have to uh, they they should stand in the their goods okay i sign like i can deliver uh, 2000 per day things so every day they have to supply okay so it doesn't matter uh, that is a lack of resources lack of human power so uh, the buyer don't bother about it okay so in what way they can do end of the day they have to deliver as as per uh, sign in the contract Okay, two thousand bottles required means two thousand should be supplied in time on that day. Okay, like that. Then, in terms of uh, quality, okay, so quality is a so first criteria. Priority is given more for the quality. Okay, for example, uh, I am uh, purchasing or uh, buying vegetables, greens from a from a farmer, from directly from a farmer. Okay, so the farmer have to give a quality. vegetables like that fresh one okay not an uh, the one which is uh, harvested uh, before uh, long back like that okay so they don't do like that so they are looking for a fresh one means so they have to supply like that okay so they should stand in their quality then quantity then in price okay 
Okay, so I signed for some amount. Then later afterwards I demand for some more amount means. So that is also is not uh, that is that's not uh, uh, that will break the relationship between the customer and supplier. So supplier wants to sign in the contract for quantity, quality, price, and uh, type of delivery and type of pay payment. They both should they stand on their words. Okay, so supplier is responsible for supplying things. Time in quantity in the quality. So likewise, the buyer have to narrate what are their actual requirement in terms of all these things. Okay. Then what else? What other principles should be followed by buyer and seller? Yes. That's it. We should both respect each other, independent of each other. Then. Uh, Supplier have to is responsible for supplying uh, uh, satisfying all the demands. Then customer has to the buyer has to generate all their requirements. Then both are responsible for ensuring the quality. Okay. So end of the day they have to satisfy the customer end user. And supplying this case, so supplying this case in the sense I have to supply the quality one. Okay, the taste level one. Okay, right. Otherwise, uh, suppose I am compromised with the taste, or uh, if, I, if I want to get more profit, okay. So I, I add some more increments to give more uh, to increase the the number of count, okay. So it will compromise the taste and quality means. So what is happening? The customer will not be satisfied, okay. So both are responsible for the quality of an end service, okay. So in terms of product uh, process. Or any other thing. Okay, so these are the basic principles. Then how to sustain the relationship, buyer and supplier relationship. Okay, so by doing the compliance and contact, uh, for our contact, then strategic financing. So compliance means so why uh, you are uh, asking the uh, seller, uh, that is uh, the supplier. For example, it means from the former you are asking.
there is a long term relationship between both of you, between both of you. Okay? What is an uh, uh, impact? Okay? Or if you have a relation with them, another one for a short term. So, what is an impact? What is the benefit? Yeah. 